Okay, I'm not even sure what training day this is, what week it is, how many weeks until the competition. If you're not getting tired of watching me do the same lifts over and over, I'm at least getting tired of recording the same lifts over and over. So I'm gonna do one or two more of these training vlogs and then cut it off and wait until competition. December 7th, 2019, here at Untamed Strength Gym in Sacramento, California. Starts at 9 a.m. I'm competing. Come watch, free for spectators. See you there. All right, in this video, I wanna talk about the rack position for the front squat and how to improve it. A lot of people struggle with this position. It hurts their wrists. They don't have shoulder mobility to get in this position and they wanna know what to do about it. I want everyone to realize that we are all adaptable creatures with the ability to change and the ability to improve. We're not robots, we're not machines, we're not cars. So as we're exposed to something more and more and more, we tend to get better at it. So my advice is to front squat more if you wanna get better at front squat. Expose yourself to being in that front rack position more often and it will become easier and easier. As far as mitigating pain, I would suggest selecting a weight that is manageable or tolerable. It's okay if it's slightly uncomfortable. You're not doing anything wrong. Over time, it'll get more and more comfortable. And it's important to trust the process and not be in a rush to add a bunch of weight. That will come with time. The more you expose yourself to this front rack position, the more familiar you'll be with it. And the last thing that I'll say about improving your front rack position is be mindful of the things you're telling yourself, the words you're telling yourself, or the words that you're even saying out loud. Don't say things like, I feel like my wrists are gonna break. The front rack position is killing my wrists. You're being dramatic, and the words that you say to yourself and out loud have an impact on how quickly you improve or how quickly you don't improve. And this doesn't just apply to the front rack position, it can also apply to any management of pain. Is this amount of crotch tear acceptable? Let me know your thoughts, comment down below. Thanks for watching and always remember, Tread on time.